guys, I'm at uh, HEB and the wine guy, they're out of my favorite, where is the camera? There it is. The wine, they're out of my favorite wine, but the wine guy suggested this. I'm big on sweet wine. I'm not exactly a connoisseur, so this is a Muscat from Texas. Muscato, for those of you that are a little more in the know. I have my bag of limes. Yay. And then uh, to start off the evening, I'm a big fan of uh, vodka tonic, so I'm getting diet tonic water, which is a little lower in calories. So, you know, start off the evening with a cocktail and finish up with the wine and it is going to be a fun evening. And I've run into like half of our high school in the liquor department, which doesn't say much. <laughs> We're gonna have fun. We'll be responsible. Michael's not drinking. Michael really doesn't drink. He doesn't, he doesn't really like it, which is good. So he can drive us home. And uh, yeah, so now off to DSW to look for white shoes in October. This should be interesting. In yet another installment of my glamorous life, I'm gonna shower. And before I do that, I have to empty the drain. So when we redid our bathroom, we had this really cool drain put in where there's like a hair catch thing inside and there's a special tool that pops the drain lid, this thing, the uh, drain cover. There it is. Pops that off. Isn't that a cool floor? Yes, I'm still in my rain boots. Um, I love my floor. It's like, it's textured and it's awesome. Anyway, I accidentally threw out the cool plastic tool that came with it. So now I just pop it up with a screwdriver and pull out all the hair, which is disgusting and I'm going to share it with you. So if you have a sensitive stomach, turn away. So I just pop this open, because if I don't do this, then what happens is as someone is showering in here, the water starts rising and it will overflow. So anyway, and then all that grossness gets caught by this thing. Come out. Ew, I can't believe I'm touching it. Ah, gross. Anyway, it gets stuck on this and doesn't go down the drain so that I don't have to call a plumber. So I'm gonna go get a paper towel and clean that disgusting mess out. It's like soap scum and hair. So I usually am the one that cleans it because it's usually mostly my hair. And anyway, I'm gonna clean that out. I hope I've completely disgusted all of you and <laughs> I'm gonna go get dressed. It's still raining. It's 4.30, it's still raining. Hey guys, I'm ready for the what's the, I don't know what I'm saying, the white party. Jake and his girlfriend are over there. He's, I don't know what's going on there, it's just not normal. Um, I am wearing my bobble bar necklace, one of the shirts I picked up in the Nordstrom sale, loft white jeans. You two can stop giggling now, I can hear you. And then I'm wearing my Jimmy Choo, sparkly shoes, but when the dancing gets serious, I bought these shoes that Michael absolutely hates, which makes me love them even more. I have these, aren't they fun? I've always wanted these and he hates them and I don't care. Oh, and I am wearing, what else am I wearing? Parasol studs from Bobble Bar and my Pave Lynx bracelet. So I'm ready to party. See you at the party. She looking at them? Hey, who's not doing a uh, market? Oh, $600 name for $500 right there. $600 name for $100 going to do. $600 name for the Oh, Lordy. If you divide that by 10 people, he said $50. $600 over here, thank you. Now $700 right there. Thank you. 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 Thank I gotta show you my shoes. Hang on. <laughs> Aren't they awesome? But I brought backup shoes. I got these. These are my dancing shoes. And Michael is not pleased. Anyway, we have had a few cocktails. No, you have not had any cocktails. Oh, look at these. Party favors. Everyone has white glasses. I f everybody's in white. I feel like we're at a mass baptism. Yes. It's pretty neat, actually. It's pretty cool. Let me turn it around so you can see what's going on.
have to be able to read non-stop. You have to like reading. You have to be very good at quick reading and yeah. impromptu speaking. Hey, Michael. Say like hi. Looks, this is on uh, yes. video right now? Yeah, it is. Okay. It's no hands Old school on the iPhone. <laughs> party I got basically zero footage because there's loud music I was socializing with lots of friends um, it's all sports so all the people that I don't always get to see are all in one spot so it was really nice to see all kinds of people plus our middle school coaches were there and it was just it was a great night I got to dance on stage with the band with a bunch of other moms I don't know if I already got that footage or not but just in case I didn't get the footage from the dad who filmed the whole thing um, a bunch of us got on stage and danced to Pitbull's Fireball that was a blast that was I've always wanted to get on stage and dance with the band that was so fun I love dancing I don't know if y'all know that but I love dancing and Michael's a good sport puts up with it so my hair didn't really make it through. It got all kind of frizzy and stuff, but my makeup stayed put, which is amazing. My shirt was soaking wet. We danced like crazy people and screamed and so much fun. It's only once a year, but we really have a good time and we raised good money. And the best part was that I bid on the Colleen Rostal package that got donated and I won, yay! So I got all my own skincare line back, so that was awesome. I have no voice, I'm tired, so I'm gonna call it a night. Thanks for spending another day with me. We have about a week left. I don't know how I feel about that, kind of sad, but um, I'll see y'all in the morning. Well, no, I will see you, I'll see the camera in the morning. I'll see y'all tomorrow night. Thanks for watching, bye. Hey guys, I'm getting ready to go to the football game, and as expected, rain showers are predicted, and it's getting darker and darker outside. I'm as pinked out as I'm gonna get, minus my poncho. I even wore a workout 